Hey there, it's Tobias over at Ted Russell Ford, 9925 Parkside Drive, Knoxville, Tennessee, 37922 if you're doing the navigation thing. And uh, today, we're talking about our Subaru Crosstrek. Let's take a look. So, what we're talking about today is this Subaru Crosstrek here. This is a 2018, of course it's in the red as you can see. Zoom out a little bit for you. Just do a little walk around. Now, it has been raining, so forgive me. There's a little bit of dampness on the car. Uh, on this one, it has about 35,000 miles. It's 34,780 uh, on the mileage. Uh, and just kind of giving you a little peek at it. I know it's hard to do stuff when you can't see the vehicle in person. Uh, and you can't make it out because everybody has busy lives. So, uh, on there, I just want to kind of give you a little preview. And on that, I'm pretty sure that's not... Yep, ew. Uh, not a scratch. Definitely not a scratch. Ew. Um, wipes right off. I me to wash my hands when this is over. Um, so, on there. No blemishes that I can see. Uh, let's take a look, a little closer look. So, uh, of course, you've got the uh, power locks, power windows, power mirrors. Uh, let's take a closer look over here. All right. So, here we are. Now, uh, the layout on this one's a little bit different than most of my other vehicles, which are typically Fords and stuff like that. Um, we do get an occasional Subaru, but uh, the information screens are a little bit different. You'll notice you've got uh, right there, you've got your temperature, uh, average miles per gallon, and the time up there, and it's its own little display. Uh, down here, you've got your uh, normal touch screen for media controls and all that fun stuff. Uh, over here, you can also control the uh, media on the wheel, pick up the phone, hang up the phone, change source, all that good stuff. Cruise controls over here. Uh, it does have the option for automatic headlights, so you just set it to that and never mess with it again. Um, other than that, uh, pretty normal setup. Now, this does have, if you look real close there, uh, it's got the heated seats in the front. Um, now, the seating material uh, is cloth uh, on there, but it's a very good looking cloth. Um, and it also has a, uh, a moonroof up there that, uh, whoop, hey, look, it's raining. So there's that. And uh, give me just a moment. I'll give you kind of the bird's eye view and uh, kind of a little fly through on the vehicle so you can get a feel for it. So on this, uh, as you can see, it already has the floor tray liner uh, in there. I'm just looking at everything look with a critical eye here, looking for anything. And I don't really see any damages or blemish or anything like that. So... Kind of your view from the driver's seat. And hopefully you find this helpful. That's all that. And we've also got the storage in the back. There, there's a cover already in here. But that, that's what you're looking at there. Whoop. And it does have one of my favorite things on any of the hatchbacks, which is this little cover here, because you inevitably scuff things going in and out, and this helps protect against that. So, on there, uh, it's also got a pretty rugged liner in the back, it looks like. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, you can also privacy cover it, so say you're at the mall, people can't peek in, that kind of stuff. So, and those seats do fold down and they already have the hard backing on them. So if you're like me and you haul your dogs around, because that's what we do when we own dogs, uh, this would actually be a pretty, uh, pretty good setup. You can get one of those uh, uh, longer uh, dog bed type mats to go in here and not worry about things getting scratched up as they do with my boxers. So um, anyway, there's that. So yes, that vehicle is still available for sale right now while it lasts, always while it lasts. Uh, had a lot of people miss out on deals just because they're like, oh, I'll be there in a few days. And I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> so um, anything I can do for you, any questions you might have, uh, any information I can get that would help you make your decision to come on down, let me know. Uh, that number here is 865-251-3673. That's 865-251-3673. Uh, my name's Tobias. And if I can help, I sure would love to. Uh, the address again is 9925 Parkside Drive. That's 9925 Parkside Drive, Knoxville, Tennessee, 37922. Uh, looking forward to helping you all out. Thank you so much.